Porato i tai tūtahi mai, tāko tūkona a kupe. Nō ko ei nā reke reke hau i heke mai, i roto hoki ana haka pau tāra tia. Te sahi ana taha ko tāna tēa, i waihua mai e ia. Nā reka, e mihi ana tia koutou hai mai. So we've been bringing the hikoi down from the far north, carrying this issue all the way to Wellington. But what we say is that we're not the hikoi, you're the hikoi. And all we are is just a spark that's been taking the issue down the country uh, until we get to Wellington. But here's, here's the thing, folks. Uh, we're arriving in Wellington on the 4th of May, and I'd like to invite you all down there for a massive party. It's the Aotearoa is not for sale party, and it's going to be happening down in Wellington. So we've seen a fantastic turnout of people here today. Just imagine what it's going to be like if all of you are with the people of Wellington in a couple of weeks' time. We're not just going to march on uh, Parliament and then go home the next day. We're staying down there for a week. We're going to have a range of demonstrations and activities around the uh, Wellington area, targeting Peter Dunn, the other weak link in the, um, the political chain. If we can roll him, and if we can roll um, Johnny Banks, well, then it's all over for the national government. So that's our objective. Kia the other thing is we're going to be targeting the multinational companies like uh, Petrobras through the Brazilian Embassy, the mining companies which are all part of this asset stripping uh, campaign that the government's involved in. We're here today because we know that the world is embracing clean energy and right now we collectively own some of the key clean energy companies in the world that can export this technology and be part of the clean energy revolution that this planet so desperately needs. But they, we won't be part of that future if we privatise and sell off these assets. Remember there's only one vote in it. And right now, do you know whose vote that is? It's John Banks. What kind What kind of a mandate do they have to sell the assets built up by generations of New Zealanders that will be needed by future generations on the basis of one vote? John Banks's vote, who is in, currently ensconced in a donation scandal. That is no mandate, that's wrong, and we're going to change it. Know this, let the message of this march be this to all politicians, except me of course, all politicians, <laughs> that the power in this country is outside of the House of Parliament. <laughs> and the day that we all wake up to that fact is the day we finally become free from the rape and the pillage of our nation. Yeah! One more time. Aotearoa is not for sale. Aotearoa is not for sale. Tell John Key to go to hell. Tell John Key to go to hell. There's a placard around here, you might have seen it. What Parliament does, the streets can undo. And in France, in Greece, in Spain, in Iceland, in Syria, and in Egypt, the people there have no time for the laws the Parliament passes. They go out into the streets and they get rid of the politicians that bring governments down. We can do that here in New Zealand, if you want to hear how. Join me for a beer over in the Brooklyn Bar in five minutes. Sure, yeah. keep it on, keep it on the streets. What Parliament does, the streets can undo. You know they never could have stopped me. They never could have brought me down. You know they never could have blocked me. Yeah.